29 forecast. Well, there's a lot, and I do mean a lot of weather to talk about. Let's get right to it. Hello, I'm meteorologist Josh Fitzpatrick. We'll start off with the winds today, gusting up to 50, even 65 miles per hour. The higher gusts over the higher elevations. So make sure those Christmas decorations are secure. Those inflatables are deflated. This could also cause a few power outages over the next, say, 12 hours or so. Temperatures are still above freezing temporarily. 44 right now with wet conditions in Charlottesville and 35 in in Stanton, but watch what happens mid to late morning, midday, already well below freezing. And here's this evening in the single numbers and teens with wind chills even lower than that. So we are concerned about a refreeze or a flash freeze. NBC 29's live Doppler radar network is showing us some showers. We had an inch to two inches of rain yesterday, so we have water coming off the hillsides onto the roadways, additional moisture on the ground with these showers out ahead of the Arctic front, and this is going to freeze in a hurry. So any standing water is going to turn to a glare ice. There's a live view at Airport Road and Route 29. It's wet, but give it another three to four hours. And this is going to freeze because the temperatures are going to plummet to below freezing levels. Already seen a few snow and rain showers into the Shenandoah Valley across I-81, but the accumulating snows are going to stay west across the Allegheny Highlands and into West Virginia and the Ohio Valley up into the Great Lakes area. Look at all this cold air. There's no escaping it, folks. Well below zero from the Ohio Valley into the Northern Plains. So I'm not concerned about the snow. Yeah, there'll be some snow points west, but we here at home are concerned about that quick freeze, the flash freeze. So icy areas will be a concern going into today and tonight. Look at the wind chills, the feels like temperature tonight into tomorrow or even later today through tomorrow morning will be well below zero. So make sure you download the Storm Team 29 weather app. If you don't have it on your smartphone or tablet just yet, you can scan that QR code, get our hour by hour outlook, the Doppler radar, the alerts and our weather other video briefings right to the palm of your hand to your smartphone or our tablet. So in that forecast for today, that wintry mix will end a big time refreeze already by 9 a.m. in Charlottesville will be below freezing. And then in the teens by the end of the day with wind chills well below zero overnight lows and the single numbers and wind chills will be well below zero. This is some of the coldest temperatures we've had in a couple of winters around here with highs tomorrow in the upper teens and low 20s for the valley and mid to low 20s across central Virginia with wind chills still below zero through at least midday tomorrow. Seven day forecast in the teens on Christmas Eve tomorrow evening Christmas Day. We'll have some sunshine, less wind with highs barely freezing in the 30s on Monday, 40s on Tuesday and Wednesday and hey 50s. It'll feel warm to us by next Thursday.